mineral companies will sell you anything that they want. Anything that they think you need. And they're just, they feel like they're tossing cash out the window. And that's the worst thing for a rancher to feel like. I'm trying to find a solution to find a mineral that actually gave back. It's a game changer. We haven't had a customer or a buyer call us back and say, I do not like the program that you guys are on. They say, are you selling more calves? My name is Lane Larson. I'm the ranch manager and the general manager here at the Diamond Cross Ranch in Bernie, Montana. I've been here about 10 years. It's all Black Angus, and uh, we've done some crossbreeding with some uh, with Top Hereford. I think mineral in general is just outrageous in price. There's a reason that people are trying to figure out mineral programs is because whatever they're using isn't working for them. And they're just, they feel like they're tossing cash out the window and, and, and that's the worst thing for a rancher to feel like is there's no benefit. I'm trying to find a solution to low cost inputs and maximum benefit to find a mineral that actually gave back. I want, I want my cows to get the minerals they need from grass. We've tried loose mineral from, from a couple different companies. Uh, we've tried lick tubs from a couple different companies. A lot of those mineral packages don't work. Other mineral has worked just fine and they consume it just fine. Uh, they over consume it. And, and that's, that's the problem. Most mineral companies will sell you mineral and sell you mineral and sell you mineral and never come out, never look at the cows, never worry about consumption. In fact, the more they consume, the more you're supposed to buy. It pisses me off. Mineral companies will sell you anything that they want, anything that they think you need, and they don't back it up. And Rio Max is, has backed up uh, their word when we needed them to. The most of these cows eat is four ounces, and that's when we move pastures. About a 10-day cycle, and then it'll drop back down to two, two to three ounces. We started Rio Max in 2019, I believe. So stems in the manure where we were feeding the loose mineral was two to three inches long in the manure. Went over to another herd and looked at the Rio Max, and we're looking at, you know, a quarter to a half inch of, of stem. They're utilizing the feed better, and we're also feeding less hay. So we went from 38 pounds a head a day to 30 pounds through the dead of winter. I'm feeding later, I'm going out to pasture earlier, and I'm feeding less hay. It's a game changer. Um, I, would, I would say we probably feed between uh, 70 and $100,000 less feed in the winter. So, Put that back to bulls or put it wherever you want it. The diamond cross breeds for 45 days and we're, we're bull bred. I would say 80% of our calves are born within the first cycle, specifically on the heifers. Our heifers uh, start calving March 15th. We were 90% done with those by April 15th. So that's the name of the game is having uniform calves three-year-olds they outbred our old cows and uh, we would have had Rio Max for two years definitely um, utilizing and seeing the benefits of the Rio Max as as well as the ranch financially last year we had a wet year the grass cured out about June 15th um, we shipped the heaviest calves that we've ever shipped from the Diamond Cross uh, right off right off this place right here they're about 38 pounds heavier than normal, which I think was was definitely part of the Rio Max program, along with environmental conditions. But I think the utilizing every nutrient in that grass and utilizing it better is is what helped out. And I think the cows and calves finally got got everything in their system and got used to it, and and we had a great year. We haven't had a customer call us back or a buyer call us back and say, I do not like the program that you guys are on. They say, are you selling more calves? The sticker price was, was one that was tough to swallow. Uh, any mineral company has prices that are going up. The benefits to Rio Max would be the consumption stop. 
we know that they're going to eat two to four ounces a day. And if they eat more than that, then the company backs it up. And we had to use that. And, and the company came through, Rio Max came through on that. I could go get mineral all day long from any company I wanted to. But none of those companies back up what they say as far as they're supposed to eat two to four ounces. Well, when you go to, go to them and tell them that they're eating six, they're gonna say, well, do you want another load? And at that point you say, hell no. I feel like Rio Max is the tub that, that pays for itself. Um, breed back, uh, calving, through calving, uh, through through drought, through wet years, they're they're eating the mineral, and and we're still seeing uh, less feed costs. Uh, I think our cows are probably eating less grass. I see them laying down a lot more during during the midday. Um, they're happy. They're content. You go out there and you look at the manure, and it's it's nice oatmeal looking manure. Um, it's it's just consistent. Everything is consistent through the last five years.